All right, guys, Sunday fun day. This is take two. Um, I am doing 20 watches. Link in the description. Um, there'll be a, a real-time list that I'll keep up to date to purchase one. You just email. It is first come, first serve. It's USA shipping. UPS, you'll be paying with PayPal. You'll be paying directly to the seller of the watch, and then you will be paying me shipping. That's the way it works, just so you know. And once you email and I email you back, that means you are first up to purchase. So just follow the instructions I give to you. Very clear, easy to follow instructions. Do it exactly as I say, and it's a smooth transaction. Trust me, I've done this a couple times. Okay, first up, Christopher Ward, World Glow C1, running at plus four seconds. It has a Solita SW330 in it, and this guy will be $800. It does come with a full box, so... Most of these do come with full box. There's a few I'm going to sh share with you in a little bit here that do not. So, yeah, great shape, great condition on this guy. Um, you know, display case pack, all that good stuff. Leather still in great shape. Only $800. Um, those are discontinued, and I know there's a lot of people that were trying to get those to Christopher Ward to actually start making those again. Um, I think they stopped making them at like 21 or 22. Um, next up, Venezianico. Um, 39 millimeter blue diver here this thing's running at plus four seconds and yeah there's a little bit of wear i mean nothing too insane for polished center links i mean it's overall in pretty good shape and this will come with a full box and everything we'll do this one for 300 dollars. butterfly glass 300 dollars. all prices are not including shipping shipping is extra i only charge you exactly what the shipping is plus a small fee for like the box and everything like that because I come out of pocket on those. So next up, Zen 105 UTC. This thing is running plus minus zero. It is running spot on. Again, Salita SW330. And this guy, bi-directional bezel. I just did a video on this, but I haven't posted it yet. On the full bracelet. Yeah, there's a couple little marks on there, but with this blasted case, it kind of, um, you know, doesn't really show up that well. Full box, all that good stuff. Swatch isn't even very old, honestly. We'll do this one for $1,450 plus shipping. Don't forget that. And when you go up to the higher price points, you got to remember we do insured through pirate ship. So the insurance actually covers the loss of a watch um, if it happens. I have yet to lose one. I've, I've not had to do an insurance claim yet on a watch. So $1,450 on that. But keep in mind the the uh, Shipping and insurance is going to be a little bit. It'll you know be 30, 40 bucks, something like that. Same thing for this guy here because the higher price point. This is the Tudor Black Bay 58 925 Silver used. Of course, there's going to be a little bit of patina on there. And this silver scratch is easy, so there's going to be a little bit of... So I'm, I'm just trying to make sure you see everything. Still in great shape. You'll see some marks on the back here from changing out the strap. This thing is running at plus one second. We'll do this one for $2,300 plus the shipping and all that stuff. And yes, it comes with a box. Um, yeah, great shape. Incredible price on a 925 Silver. I mean, that's sometimes that's what you're going to pay for like a really nice condition uh, stainless steel one. So why not try the silver one? Next up, we have another Venezianico. Um, this is the ultra black and the 40 millimeter, no box, no papers. It is going to be just the watch. I'm going to wrap it up nicely. It'll go in a nice little orange padded envelope and then it'll go in a box. Um, but that's the way I do these when there's no um, box or anything. So this guy here is running minus 10 seconds, actually running a little bit slow. Um, and we'll do this one for $300. These are sold out. Every time they do a drop on one of these, they're instantly sold out. So 300 bucks, save yourself some money, and then you can actually get one too. So you can see I do, I always do below market value. Um, sometimes market value is hard to figure out. So I just kind of wing it. Um, look, I gotta keep this in order here. MMI turret, where's that watch? Over here. I got to go in the order that I wrote them down on the paper. So this is an MMI turret, 300 meter. This one's on a Tropic strap, MI, MMI Tropic strap. And it still has the plastic. Uh, no, it doesn't have the plastic on the back. I left a little bit of res residue. Oh, wait, does it? Oh, yeah, it still has the plastic on the back. Um, doesn't look like it's been worn, to be honest with you. Running at plus 15 seconds. 
No bracelet with this one, no box or anything like that. Again, I'll just wrap it up, put it in a padded envelope, put it in a box. This guy here is going to be $225 plus shipping, $225. So good deal on that guy. Uh, those are sold out. So uh, Richard Legrand, I think it's called, the Ocean Fair, running at plus minus zero. So it's running spot on. Does have a nice bracelet that comes with it. No box, no papers, no extra links. It does fit my wrist, which is, you know, I keep saying seven and a quarter. It, it might be a little bit larger than that. I need to lose a little bit of weight. Um, so if you have a seven and a quarter inch wrist or smaller, then you're golden here. You're good to go. We'll do this thing for $150 hairs. Not actual doll hairs, dollars, guys. Actual U.S. dollars via PayPal, USA shipping. Um, I don't know how to pronounce this one. This one is pretty wild. It is like, it's still wrapped in the plastic. It's, I don't think it's ever been worn or sized or anything. Um, I-K-I-G-A. I don't know how to say that. But this is the Maru, and it is the Mint. It is running at plus two seconds. This is one of those cases that has like all the loom on the side and everything. It's just loomed out everywhere. And it will be um, $250. No box, no papers, all that good stuff. Okay, Small batch of them that I got in that they didn't have anything. Next up is a Trasca Free Diver in the Mint. I think this is the first gen, judged by the case shape and everything. Still in great shape. Fits my wrist size, so seven and a quarter or smaller. You can see the scratches there. No box, no papers, no extra links. And it is running at plus four seconds. Love the bezel action on this. Surprised to see the scratches on this, actually, because don't, doesn't the uh, Trosca have, like, the scratch-resistant coating? It's interesting. Yeah. Oh, well, it got scratched. So um, $300 on that one. Awesome. One of my favorite mint dials, period. Next up, Baltic Bicompax Chronograph in PVD gold. It's not real gold. Don't get excited. And it does have the uh, manual wine seagull movement on the back. So you, or, you know, display case back so you can see it. And this guy here is running at plus nine seconds. No box, no papers, all that good stuff. We'll do this one for, these are um, pretty expensive watches actually. We'll do this one for $350, $350. Okay, this one, I'm going to take a minute with this one because... This is another watch that um, multiple larger review sites have begged Oris to make this watch again. They don't make this watch anymore. It is titanium, so it's nice and lightweight. And if you buy this, I'm actually going to hold this back and do a video on that. I'll probably try to record the video on Tuesday. So if you do buy this, there's going to be a delay in the shipping. I, I want to make a video on this one. I think there's one other one I want to make a video on. But this one I definitely want to make a video on. Because it is just probably one of the coolest Oris Aquas that I've handled. So it is um, so 30 bar, 300 meter. It is a regulator movement. So it's an automatic regulator movement. So you can see the running seconds there over at the 9 o'clock. Of course, you have your hour here. And then, of course, you have your large minute hand hour or um, minutes. That's your hour. That's your date. Uh, a non-display -dis case back, so it has like this pretty cool uh, thing done on the back of the titanium case. Full bracelet, full box, comes with this huge box, so it's going to be a large box, um, and then has the tools, has the extra screws and everything, and um, it'll come with two different sets of screws because, weirdly enough, there's a different screw for the bracelet versus the strap. So it's not often you see full kit with bracelet and the strap. It has a, a nice quick on-the-fly adjust on the red rubber strap, and it's still titanium hardware. So, and this guy is running at, um, well, let's see, what did I write down? Um, well, it's a regulator, so it's running at plus minus zero seconds. So you could use this to regulate your other watches. So, because it's running spot on, helium escape valve, all that things. So, full kit, bracelet, strap, ex, you know, the big box, the, the extra screws, the screwdriver, everything. Um, and a pretty rare watch, pretty hard to get in this condition and with full kit. $1,600 on that one. But like I said, I got to hold it back. I need to make a video on it. Next up, Mundane. 
This is the MST4161B.LB. This is, I still got the sticker on the front. This is um, one of those backlight watches. I kind of want to do the video on this one too. So there's no loom on the front. The loom, you can't see it, but it's on the underside of the hour and minute hand. It actually puts off a really cool effect because when it's charged up, um, it just like reflects the glow down onto the dial. It's really fun, a really cool watch. Automatic movement, of course, uh, Solita SW200, if I'm not mistaken. Um, this guy here is running at plus 10 seconds. We'll do this one for $350. And yeah, it does have the box and everything. All right, so Baltic Oris Mundane Seiko. Check this one out. Here's another one. You are never, well, you're not never. Like, other people have done it. But this Titanium Shogun did not come on bracelet. It came on strap. So you had to buy the, the bracelet separate. Um, so this one has the bracelet, no strap. Pretty cool. SBDC 131 running at plus seven seconds. So watch on bracelet, titanium, awesome white dial. We'll do this one for $650. And check out the date magnifier. It's the best date magnifier that I've um, seen from Seiko. Like it's actually legit. It works great. Uh, a weird watch, one that you don't see very often. A 960, this is their field watch, comes with uh, I don't know, a bunch of extra straps, okay? Comes with a bunch of extra straps, which is cool. And this this NATO, this suede NATO style strap is awesome. And it's actually a 960 strap. That is an awesome fabric, or NATO suede, suede leather strap. Um, so a full loom dial, and it has like a bunch of like kind of like code Easter eggs and everything on here. Uh, sold out, super rare. Couldn't find anything to judge of what I needed the price of that. So we'll do this one for, let's do $300. I think this is an incredible, unique find for $300. It honestly should go for more than that. And I need to write that down because I just now picked that price. So I got to write that down. Okay, next up, this one's actually mine. The Vero Hooligan. And yeah, there's some scratches on the bull bar, but it is a Cerakoted watch and it's been sitting out. So it's a little dusty. Sorry about that. Um, they didn't make very many of these. I think 130. So they're not numbered, but they just didn't make very many. It was just a limited edition. I have the full box. It's a really cool kit. It's all hooligan matched and everything. I put it on this Zurich strap, which I think just works better on it. Uh, it does come with this strap, which, you know, maybe you like it. I don't. But... We'll do this guy for uh, $500. Now, this is these are just sold out and super rare. That is above what the retail price was, but that's fair market value for sure. Okay, next up is a Draken. Where did it go? Where's my Draken? Oh, it's right here, right in front. Tagula running minus 10 seconds. And uh, does it fit my wrist? I didn't even try it on. I don't, I don't think I have any extra links or box or anything like that so this will be a no kit watch and yeah there's plenty of micro adjust and it fits my wrist so you, you know seven and a half interest no problem on this guy we'll do this thing for 200 bucks great loom on that thing too awesome watch okay let me turn the page because that's number 16 we have four more to go we have a hamilton jazz master back here fully wrapped still uh yeah Occasionally, I get watches in like this. So this is a, a GMT Jazzmaster. This thing is running at plus 14 seconds. I can't remember. Is this a... Okay, so this is the... This is a Caller's GMT. I couldn't remember. So it's a Caller's GMT. Um, still great watch. Hamilton can't beat it. GMT still in the wrapping and everything. Uh, $450. And yeah, it comes with like, I don't know if it's the official Hamilton big box thing. It just comes in like the little Hamilton little travel pouch thing. So, and then I have this really weird one. I didn't know anything about this brand until I just opened this up. Uh, Moles? Is that what it's called? Um, it's the 528 and it is the silver two-tone. So it has silver with a dark over there on the top of graphite. Kind of gold tones to it, skeletonized hands. Pretty wild looking watch. Automatic movement. These are limited edition. They're sold out everywhere, all that good stuff. Um, pretty cool watch. Maybe I'll do a video on it. I'm not sure. So, is that a screw down crown? I think it is. I don't think I pushed it down. I think it is a screw down crown. 
Yep, it is. I had to catch the threads. Um, weird dimensions, too. I'll, I'll try to measure them real quick because I know this is going to be a weird one for people to pick because you're not going to know about it. So 45 millimeter wide, but the lug to lug is only 41 and a half, 41.6. So pretty interesting watch. It is running at plus 10 seconds. We'll do this one for $350 and they sold for a lot more money than that. So uh, hopefully I'm not way out of line on that one. Next up, Spinnaker sp 5081 BB running a plus 15 seconds, really nice orange dial in this thing. Uh, we'll do this one for $100. And it does come with a box, I think it has extra links. It should have extra links. Last up, I am done, I'm so done. Zodiac Olympus running at plus two seconds. This is not the regular one, this is the 40 mil with a little bit longer lug to lug. This is the worn and wound limited edition they only made 150 of these i believe the part number i'm not 100 percent sure on the part number so maybe i won't even say it um but these are just rare there's only 150 of them they're super cool worn and wound awesome strap uh i might actually buy some worn and wound leather straps after seeing this one legit nice straps let me know what you guys think about that but um very cool watch running at plus two seconds we'll do this one for 500 so there you go. Good luck. It is first come, first serve. I'll, let me do the loom shot here because there's some pretty cool loom. Even the 960 is a full loom dial. That's super fun for 300 bucks. And then this guy's wild. It's like the case and everything. So, so good luck, guys. See you on the next one.